Hey, what's up everybody? It's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to root the brand new Nexus 6. Thanks to Chainfire, who, by the way, is absolutely one of the best developers on the Android platform, Google's new awesome flagship phone can now be rooted with one simple click. There's some prep work you'll need to do on your phone before you begin, but honestly not much at all. Basically, you just turn your phone off entirely. When the screen goes black, press and hold the volume down and power buttons simultaneously. This will bring up Android's bootloader menu, so from here, the rest of the work will be done on a computer. Just connect your phone to your PC, Mac, or Linux machine using a good quality USB cable, and we'll get to work on that side of things next. Okay, so over here on the computer, all I've done is hook the phone up and install the proper drivers. Your computer may handle that part automatically, but if it doesn't, or if you have any issues, you can head to the full tutorial at the link in the description below this video to download the proper drivers for your system. But the next thing to do is to grab Chainfire's root tool. It's called CF Auto Root, and that's another thing I have linked out over at the full tutorial. Once the download is finished, locate the file on your hard drive, then simply extract its contents into any folder. You'll see three script files, all starting with the word root. One is for Linux, one is for Mac, and one is for Windows. So pick the one for your operating system and double click it. The window that comes up next will warn you that if you haven't already unlocked your bootloader, this tool will do that for you. But the process of unlocking your bootloader wipes all of the data from your device. So make sure you have all the important stuff backed up before you proceed. When you're ready though, press any key to run this script. If your bootloader was previously locked, you'll see a screen with a red Android over on your phone for a minute or so. Otherwise, you'll see a wall of text scrolling by that tells you what actions the script is currently performing. When it's done, your phone will automatically reboot and you'll be rooted. Simple as that. Once it finishes booting back up, you can verify that you're rooted by downloading Root Checker from the Play Store. Then you'll be all set to go about enjoying the wonderful world of Root. But for the full breakdown, don't forget to check out my article over at the link in the description below. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time folks, but until then, happy gadget hacking!